I'm Miss Karen and I'm with Columbia County 4-H in Appland, Georgia. And we are going to be doing a series with MG Sprouts with different books. And this week's book is going to be The Sunflower House. And The Sunflower House, the author is E. Bunting. An author is typically the person who writes the story. And then there's an illustrator, which is Katherine Hewitt. And she is the person who does the artwork. All right, so first I pull out all the weeds. Then I sow my sunflower seeds. It says to set them in a line, but Dad says round and round is fine. As you can see, he's going around in a circle. So hopefully they will grow in a circle as well. I give them water every day and the shoe the pesky birds away. Go eat the berries on the tree. These sunflower seeds belong to me. As you can see, there's lots of birds. The package says they're guaranteed. A mammoth flower grows from each seed. My friend Bernice says, there's no way. You don't know everything, I said. Wait! Wonder what he's gonna wait for. The stems poke up all ringed around, a pale green circle in the ground. So they are coming up in a circle. They're growing tall, they're growing fast. And oh my gosh, sunflowers at last. All frilly yellow, big and bright, Mammoth is the word, all right, for they're bigger than his head. Their petals open wide and spread a golden roof above my head. My friends come rushing down to see the sunflower house had grown by me. There's lots of room inside for three. Mom brings up cookies and iced tea, but mom and dad can't fit it all. They're much too big and wide and tall. So the whole family is engulfed in the sunflower garden. All summer long, the house is ours. We play in it for hours and hours. It's a castle, it's a cage. We jungle beasts that roar and rage. My friends sleep out with me one night bundled up and snuggled tight. Moon shadows shiver on the ground. The sunflowers whisper all around. They whisper songs of heart and heat and pain, rain, excuse me, and things too secret to explain. I see the stars peekaboo and wish, I wish, that can't come true. One day the leaves are tingling with brown. A flower comes tumbling, rumbling down. Next day some more bent over and fall. And now it's not a house at all. We tied it up with strings and sticks, but it's impossible was it's gone there's nothing we can do not even with glue all kinds of glue wait there's still the puffy middle part that's filled with seeds enough to start another sunflower house next spring with walls a roof and everything. It's neat to think when something's gone, a part of it goes on and on. It's such a super duper plan. We pick out all the seeds we can. And as you can see, it kind of makes like a little nest looking thing. 
Our pockets bulge, the blue jays come, the sparrows, the crows, they all take some. We still have lots and lots to share. Now be aware, prepare and take care. Next summer, they'll be everywhere. Now you go and plant you a sunflower flower.